morning guys and welcome back to another weekly vlog. It is Monday today and I'm sitting at my desk. It is almost 11 a.m. and I just thought I would take a break from studying. So like I said today is Monday and next Monday, so in exactly seven days, I have my linguistics end of semester exam. So this week I'll just be studying for that and that's basically all I'll be doing in terms of uni work. This morning I planned out my whole week. Got like my weekly planner all done up. If you don't have a weekly planner, I highly recommend it. My one's from Kmart for like, probably, I think it was like three bucks or something. And it literally saves my life. So unfortunately this week probably won't be the most interesting in terms of like going out and having fun and being all crazy, being a reckless teen, but not that I'm that crazy anyway. <laughs> But this is SWATVAC, so next week I have an exam, then the week after I have an exam, and then I'm free. And then I can start being a crazy reckless teen. So this morning, once I wrote out my um, weekly planner, I worked out how much time I had each day to study. And then I made a study plan for this week to make sure I get all my work done. And um, so I looked at all of the stuff I had to revise. It's up on my wall. That's why I'm looking up. And there's like... How many weeks? Six or seven weeks worth of stuff because I had a mid-semester exam for this subject so I don't have to learn the whole semester, which is so great. And they gave us like kind of like a revision sheet but not really a revision sheet. They're just like, make sure you learn these things. And there's like nine main points and obviously those are all like topics. So there's like, not like I have to just learn the point. Like it's a, a topic, like each thing is a topic. And so I've worked out which ones I need to do each day. So today, because I have the whole day off, I want to try and do three of those points. Then on Tuesday, I want to do two because I have plans in the afternoon. Wednesday I want to do two. Then on Thursday I am working all day so I won't have time to do much study or any study so I'm just giving myself a day off that day. And then on Friday I'll do the last two points. So that means that I get everything done by Friday and then I have Saturday and Sunday to just like go over everything again and make sure I just really know it. But I feel like it's a lot better to just do a few topics a day and really understand them than just kind of like race through all of them. So that is the plan. Um, like I said, it's like 11 o'clock. I haven't eaten breakfast yet, so I'm gonna go make like a brunch type thing. And then I don't know if I should, I might come back and do some more work, but I also wanna go on a walk either at lunchtime or this afternoon because I just want to be able to get out of the house every day because when I'm just inside studying all day I just get kind of just kind of like sick of being inside I just get really like um what's the word I can't think of the word I'm trying to use I just get annoyed so I want to go outside and I also want to read my bible today and I might actually listen to a podcast like a christian podcast while I'm on my walk because I love podcasts they are so great and then i have bible study tonight i might also try and do my grocery shopping today because tomorrow is when i usually do it and tomorrow i'm going out to lunch with one of one of my friends which i really need to vlog because i need to introduce you guys to this friend because she's amazing and then i'm going to hang out at my parents house all afternoon and then have dinner there but i'm going to do some meal prep while i'm at their house because I have like all the ingredients and stuff that i need to do meal prep but they just have a few like fry pans and like utensils and stuff that I just don't have yet. I will eventually, but I just don't have them yet. So I'm just gonna go and borrow theirs and do some meal prep for the week, which I'm so excited about because I love doing meal prep because the food is so good and it makes my life a lot easier. But I've been talking for a very long time now. So I'm going to go and make myself some food and I'll talk to you guys later. It looks like I have not moved, but I just finished my three topics for today, which is so exciting. But um, right now, I'm not doing anything. I'm trying to like decide. Like I know things that I want to do this afternoon, but I don't know which order I want to do them in. I want to go for a walk. I need to have a shower. I need to... It's by, by the way, it's like one o'clock now. I want to try and find some healthy snack recipes because I just keep eating snacks and I need to find some healthier ones. And I'm also just getting bored of the ones that I keep buying. I want to cook some things or just find some healthier snacks. If you guys have any like healthy snack ideas, leave them in the comments below. I already have like a few ideas, but I want to have more. So I'm going to watch some YouTube videos probably and look for some healthy snack ideas then write a grocery list, and then I'll have a shower, or should I go for a walk and then have a shower? Not that I'll get that sweaty on the walk because it is so cold. I don't know, I'll figure it out. So I am just about to leave on my walk and <laughs> that's all I have to say. I better grab my keys so I can get back into my house, but I'm ready to go. Oh my gosh, it is really sunny. <laughs> So I'm out walking. I've been walking for like half an hour or a bit more and I am <laughs> like 
in shock because I found just like the most beautiful place that is like a half an hour walk away from my house and it's beautiful. It is absolutely beautiful and I never would have seen it if I didn't just take a walk in my neighborhood. So I just got back from my walk and it was honestly the best thing. I highly recommend you guys to just take a walk in your neighborhood and see what's around. I'm really hot, I need to take off my jumper. And honestly, God is so good at creating. Like, I feel like now that I'm back from my walk, I feel so like filled and so refreshed. And I honestly think it's because like God is in nature. And when you just take a step away from your life and just kind of step away from reality and just live in the world a little bit it's just so calming and peaceful especially if you find like a nice place to walk but i highly recommend it honestly the world is just so beautiful like i'm always constantly amazed and i've said it before and i'll say it again but i don't believe this world or the creation of this world is an accident like that's impossible to me maybe not to you but to me i feel like atoms just like forming together to create our world is impossible. How could that have possibly be formed by accident? Just food for thought, but now I think I'm gonna go grocery shopping. I don't have to get too many things this week, so I probably won't do like a grocery haul, but I need to get like bread and bananas and something for dinner tonight because I'm gonna do all my meal prep tomorrow, but I need something for dinner tonight. I might just grab an avocado and then have like avocado and tuna and like rice and stuff, like a little salad type thing, because that is so good. I'll have a look when I get to the shops and I need to buy a couple of other things, so I will probably go do that now. I'm home now and I didn't get much, but I'll show you what I did get because I know some people really like grocery hauls, but I'll just like show you instead of like, going through everything. So I just got some avocado, some bananas, some grapes, some bread, some garlic bread, some spaghetti, some tuna. That was the quickest grocery haul I have ever done. Now I'm gonna put this away, maybe make myself some food. It's like almost four o'clock. And I think I might do a little bit more study because I have some time. Like I finished all the study that I needed to do today, but I might do just some extra just because I have time. Or maybe just like go through what I did today again, just to make sure that it's really ingrained in my brain. But I am hungry, so I'm gonna eat some food. So I made my little, I don't even know what you'd call it, but it's just got tuna, avocado and rice and the rice is underneath all of it as well. So I'm gonna mix this together and eat it because I'm so this fills me up so much and it's such a great, like, easy meal and it's pretty healthy too. Oh my gosh, I literally look insane. <laughs> Hello guys. Today, oh my gosh, no matter what I do, it looks crazy. Today is Tuesday and um, it is, what, like 11 something <laughs> at the moment. And I have a little lunch date today, which is so exciting. I spent the morning doing my study and I finished like the study that I wanted to get done this morning. And um, then I had a shower, which is what I just did and washed my hair. And I was just blow drying my hair, which is why it looks insane. And now I'm going to do my makeup, which is nice because I don't do my makeup very often. And I think I'm gonna jam out to a new playlist that I made with all of my like favorite childhood, probably not childhood, like all of the songs that I have listened to throughout the years of my life. And it's called TB because it's throwback. So let's see what I got on here. It, it has quite a few songs on it, so I'm excited. I look like a little boy with my hair tied back, but let's see what the first song will be. Wake up in the morning <laughs> feeling like P. Diddy. Hey, Grab my glasses, I'm out the door. I'm gonna hit this city. So I'm all ready now and I'm about to go and meet Beck for lunch, which I'm so excited about. And then I'm just probably going to hang out at my parents' house and do some meal prep there and then have dinner with them tonight. 
and yeah that's my day but i'm really excited to have lunch i'm kind of starting to get hungry i have to remember to like vlog while i'm there though because last time i had lunch with it i didn't so i need to do that but i'll talk to you guys when i get there so we just got our food this is beck <laughs> hey. welcome to my vlog Hi. she has a channel i'll link it down below so oh, please so go check it out i already mentioned you in mine <laughs> i'm hungry my meal is I'm like so as big excited. as my head i'm so excited your sandwich is bigger than your head Rachel. yeah it's like triple deck i have i supposed to eat that i'm so excited though you're not going to i'm so hungry Yay. Yay. So I'm at my parents' house now and I've just spent the afternoon doing some meal prep. I did actually like a lot. I made all of those, which is so good. I'm really happy about it. So that means that I can just like go home and put them in the freezer and then every time that I want dinner, I just have to pull a meal out of the freezer the night before and heat it up and just make some veggies or some rice or something to go with it and I'm done. It's the easiest thing ever. So you guys can hardly see me right now, but um, I'm currently on the highway and um, I have parked my car in the middle of the highway because we're in this really bad traffic jam. I don't even know what's happened. Um, I think some truck has like had a pile up or something, but has covered all four lanes of the highway. So I'm just parked in the middle of the lane of the highway. That's really interesting. That's really fun. I've been here for like 10 minutes, just like parked in the same position. And I don't know how long it's gonna be till I start moving. So that's my Tuesday night. And I'm vlogging you from this position because there are policemen everywhere and I don't wanna get in trouble for vlogging while driving, even though I'm parked, so I can't really get in trouble, but still.